I will make sure in the British Bill of Rights we are legislating so we can't be overruled by the ECHR. Well, imagine the shock for those clapping in the crowd when they find out the ECHR protects the right to a fair trial, freedom of assembly and expression, the right to participate in free elections, freedom of religion and freedom from discrimination. We need to move away from the ECHR definition of asylum, right? It is, yes, you're right, we should clap that because it is important, right? It is far too broad and allows lefty lawyers to exploit it and frustrate our efforts. There is no ECHR definition of asylum. The ECHR is human rights, and the rights that may constitute barriers to removing an asylum seeker are Article 2, which guarantees the right to life, and Article 3, which prohibits torture, inhuman or degrading treatment or punishment. Which bit of that is too broad? And to justify his plan, he jumps on the Johnson Patel bandwagon of blaming what he calls lefty lawyers. The lefty lawyers. Lefty human rights lawyers. And he does it despite Johnson and Patel having been warned using dangerous language like this could put the lives of lawyers and court staff at risk. Remember, these are just legal professionals upholding the rule of law and holding the government to account. If that's not bad enough, Sunak has posted a video suggesting EU regulations could just be put in a shredder. <laughs> Going into that shredder could be regulations in vital areas such as employment rights and environmental protections. 